Honestly, I'm not a guy that comes out in slugs. I'm technical, I look for my openings, I'm very pinpoint, very accurate with my striking, and some of it is elusive too. Some of my stuff you don't see coming. Th those are the main things that I would use to describe my style of striking. My striking started off when I was a kid. I, I took Taekwondo for a few years. And then after that, I moved into wrestling. And when I was done with wrestling, I started training for MMA. I started training boxing and Muay Thai and putting it all together and adding other styles into it all. So all of that kind of combines together, makes for, for a good style. Coming from the Taekwondo background that I had as a kid, and then moving back into relearning everything, it made it a lot easier for me. You know, it's kind of that muscle memory thing, so my kicks came back to me a lot easier, and it was very fast for me to pick up on, on new things. Oh, big right hand! Robinson's got him hurt! There's always an opening, you know, in, in every spot of the fight, there's always an opening, so you just have to be able to find it and use it. The reason I got started in martial arts and Taekwondo was Bruce Lee, you know, watching him and how fast and explosive he was uh, with his striking and his movies and stuff uh, really influenced me to want to learn martial arts and learn the sport. So he'd probably be the biggest influence that I've ever had. You can see it in some of my fights, I use a lot of side kicks. In my last fight, you know, I pretty much knocked my opponent off his feet with a side kick and Bruce Lee was very famous for that very fast uh, front leg side kick. So definitely see things that he does and, and I kind of take little bits here and there and, and use it in my own style. I'm excited for this fight. Chad is a quality opponent. He's one of the best in the division. He's very explosive, heavy handed. He's got great wrestling so he, he's well rounded around you know the entire game of MMA and I'm the same way. So I think when you put two guys in the octagon together like that that are so well versed in every aspect of MMA it makes for a great fight and it's gonna be very entertaining for the fans.